Hey everyone, it's Mark with Mark's Virtual Real Estate Channel. We're back with another Upland video and we're doing another Lazy Node contest drawing today. So it's really cool that we're doing another drawing already because that means our other community build finished up very quickly. We can award a new winner today, maybe two, we'll see about that, and um, really help build this community of Lazy Nodes. Okay, if you've not seen one of my videos before, we are in Upland, a virtual real estate world where you can buy properties, trade them, sell them, flip them, collect rent, and even build on them. And cars are here too. So it's a pretty fun game. I'm also a real real estate investor as well with commercial properties, residential properties, some small businesses. I tend to keep myself really, really busy. So for me to spend as much time as I do in Upland, it's gotta be pretty cool, at least to me. And it is pretty cool how it mirrors kind of real life a little bit. So I really enjoy it. I really like it. And I'm able to do these videos as well, which kind of show me playing the game while I'm playing it. So I have an excuse to play video games because I'm making videos about them. At least that's what I tell myself. So <laughs> it's okay. No, it's also an investment too. You can spend money on it. You can earn money on it. And it's pretty fun all around. All right. So I said Mark Ferguson, Invest for More is my real real estate channel if you want to see that on YouTube. And then we love the likes, love the comments, love the shares. Keep those coming. And we're so close to a thousand subscribers. Um, let's keep that, those, that subscriber count counting increasing yes let's do that so a lazy node um is basically a community a neighborhood where people get together and decide let's build stuff let's buy stuff let's make it fun and so i kind of term the coin the term lazy node and then i didn't want it to be too involved or require too much work from people because it's a game it's relaxed i don't have time to police things so basically, all you have to do is buy properties in neighborhoods, and you're part of our lazy node. And if you want to be part of our contest where we help you build on that lazy node, you have to buy a property, start a building, and then tell us about it. That's literally all you have to do. So it's been pretty fun. We've had a number of contests, and this is where we're going to announce the winner, do a spin number wheel thingy, and pick a winner for the new um, community build. And um, it's a lot of fun. So basically what happened was, We've announced winners before, and then everybody gets together, um, takes as much spark as they want or as little spark as they want, donate it to a build. This is our last winner right here. And then we help them build their property faster. Now, there's no limit on the type of property, as long as it's in our lazy node, the player's wealth, how much money they have, experience, any of that. The only constraint we put on it is we promise to do a contest every 10 days. So if an apartment building gets picked, we don't complete the build in 10 days. We'll pick a new winner and go from there. And we're still helping that apartment a ton and people can still keep contributing if they want to, right? I'm not policing it. I'm not checking to see who's contrib contributing or not contributing. We leave it up to you guys on the honor system. So you can see we're down to 12 hours here. So I don't know if I'll post this video today or tomorrow when the build is more complete, almost done. And um, we'll pick a new winner here. And we might even pick two because what happened before with this one was we made the announcement earlier this week. Everybody contributed their spark to this small townhouse and it got up to 10 spark, which is the maximum we can have right away. And people couldn't contribute anymore. So if we pick another small townhouse, I think I might pick a second winner as well where people can contribute to the first winner. If it fills up right away, then we can contribute to a second winner as well and help two people build um, faster. Now, if we pick a, an apartment or a big townhouse, those take more spark. I don't know if we'll pick a second winner in that case, but if we do a small townhouse, I think we will do that. All right, so if you haven't entered the contest yet, you can't. <laughs> We've already done a, we do a video before where you enter in that video and comment on that video, but we'll have more contests coming up soon. So don't, don't worry, they'll come up pretty quick. Um, you don't have to wait months or anything like that. Our two lazy nodes are Henry Ford and Neponset. So you can see I've got lots of properties here. We're building lots of properties in the area. Pretty cool to see. And then um, Naponzin is the other one. Uh, this is our first winner in Henry Ford, by the way. Our other winners were all in Naponzin in Queens. That's where that neighborhood is. And we'll make our way over there, right up here. And here we have lots of properties too. I bought all these after I chose it as a node, so I didn't just choose it because I had tons of properties here. I've been buying them after those announcements. So we can see here, we built an apartment in Neponset, which was cool with a community build right here. Built another ranch over here. 
build another townhouse up here. I'm building a bigger townhouse up here. You can see lots of building, lots of activity going, so that's really cool to see. Other apartments being finished. Um, it's been a lot of fun. And so with these lazy nodes, not only have we been able to build and have fun, but we've actually been able to change things in Upland, which is kind of cool. So I'm at upexcellent.me right now, and I can go to Queens and go to Neponsent and pick a few things here, and we can see what our floor price is in Neponsent. It started out in the mid-20s, and we're at real close to 40000 We got up to 43 for a while, dropped back down. And so we've been able to raise the floor and make it a more valuable neighborhood. It's been pretty fun to do that. The same thing with Henry Ford. Oh, my mouse is being weird, sorry. We'll go to Henry Ford and see how it looks right here. Its floor started at like six to 8,000. And we're up to 28 or 29 now. So really cool to see that. And um, it's just been a lot of fun. All right, so why don't we actually get down to picking our winner and see who the winner of the next community build will be. Maybe two, we'll see. All right, so here is what I use for our free number spinner. And then we go to Discord. I should have mentioned Discord already. We have our own Discord for the Lazy Nodes too. And I've already got it opened here. But um, we have an awesome person, Riz, who keeps track of everybody who comments on the video. And then he puts them in this spreadsheet and gives them a number. And green means everybody started a build like they're supposed to. They all entered the right way. Then we post this on Discord. People have a chance to say, hey, my name's not on there. I commented or what happened? Why am I not entered? And then after they've got some time to do that, then we'll do these drawings. So you can see we have 19 people here. Um, and then we will come over here, do the spinny thing, and pick one of those 19. And I'll show you how it works as a sample. And they will be the winner. So we just simply spin it. I do that because I don't want to give someone false hope that they won. And it makes lots of fun noises. Yay! Okay, so then we'll go back here. We have 19 people. 1 through 19. And I think we're ready. Let's do our spin and see who wins the contest. The suspense is killing me, just like every time. 14? Yay, 14! Let's go see who 14 is. Milder! Milder is 14 on a state's drive. Okay. 1823. I know Milder is a big part of the Discord and comments a lot, so that's cool to see. 1823, a state's drive. So that is definitely in Henry Ford again. And let's see if it's a ranch or a townhouse. Oh, my computer is being slow. It's probably because I'm uploading another video from my other channel. <laughs> Has a lot of thinking to do. The estates area is up here. And what I say? I don't even know what I said. 1823? Let's see if it's that one. Nope, not that one. That one? Nope, not that one. That one? I could just look at the address. Nope, not that one. Oh, I have to get it. It could be in the middle. Okay, let's look at the address. 14, 1823 estates. What, what is this address here? 1677. I could just, you know, type it in right here, I guess, instead of being so dramatic. There it is. Ooh, is it a mansion? It might be. It is. Okay. So Milder has been building this um, on a state's drive, 1823 estates. It is a mansion. So this one will take quite a bit of spark from us to build this one. So I don't think I'm going to pick a second winner. I would have it for the small town home. I'm not going to since this is a big one. If um, we'll still have 10 days to see if we can get it built in 10 days and go from there. And again, 1823 Estates Drive. Let me make sure 14. Yes, that's all correct. Let me make sure 14. Yes, that's all correct. Okay, there we go. Another Detroit property. We can help build. And then, um, yeah, and love to see other people having buildings start, building properties, getting them going. So really cool to see. All right, congratulations, Milder. We'll post this video here soon. Um, we'll try and finish up this build here before we donate Spark to Mildners. So let's get this one built. Then we'll donate to the new one and keep picking people and keep building stuff. And also, I, my last few videos have just been on the contest, but I still like to do more Upland videos. So if you have ideas 
on different subjects to cover, different topics, let me know. Um, love to do some more content for Upland and different stuff. And uh, it's been a lot of fun. And if you have certain things you want me to cover, please, by all means, comment, let us know, and we'll try and help you out. All right, thanks for watching. Love the likes, love the comments, love the shares. Keep those coming. Hop on Discord if you haven't already. We'll have a link below to the Discord channel where you can comment. Lots of cool conversations going on there too. All right, we'll be back soon.